Samland Offensive The Samland Offensive was a Soviet offensive on the Eastern Front in the final stages of World War II. It took place in Zambia. The East Prussian Offensive, which commenced on January 13, 1945, had seen the Red Army clear German forces from much of East Prussia. The defenders had been driven into a series of pockets on the Baltic coast and in the city of Königsberg, in which they were besieged. Marshal Alexander Vasilevsky, who had taken over command of the Third Belarusian Front in February, incorporated General Hovayan's Bagramian's First Baltic Front into his command from February 22, redesignating it as the Zemland Army Group. Bagramian's forces initially laid siege to Königsberg, the city was eventually stormed on April 9. They were then given the task of overcoming the substantial German force still remaining in Zambia. German defence efforts had largely focused on the port of Pila at the tip of the peninsula, which was the main evacuation point for casualties and East Prussian civilians. Throughout the Battle of Königsberg, Zambia had been defended by Army Detachment Samland under the command of General Hans Galnick, who had tried to maintain a corridor between Königsberg and Pila. On April 7, the remnants of 2nd and 4th Armies, which had been destroyed in encirclements at Danzig and Heiligenbel respectively, were combined as Army Ostprussen with the task of defending Zambia, the Vistula Delta and the Hell Peninsula, Galnick's troops were incorporated in it. Most of the units of Army Ostprussen were little more than remnants, and the entire formation was very poorly supplied. During the battle for Zambia, its officers were outraged to discover that the Luftwaffe and Kriegsmarine had maintained large underground depots full of stores and fuel in the woods of the peninsula, the supplies had to be destroyed in the retreat. The offensive plan called for the 5th and 39th armies to break through towards Fischhausen as the main strike force, with the 11th Guards Army in reserve. The 2nd Guards Army would attack in the north, with the 43rd Army breaking through on the southern flank. There would also be amphibious landings in the south of Zambia. The 3rd Belarusian Front's head of intelligence suggested that they faced up to 100,000 defending troops but by shortening the frontage of each unit the attackers were able to achieve a superiority of 2 to 1 in men and 3 to 1 in artillery. Bagramian issued a call for the defenders to surrender in exchange for fair treatment and medical assistance for the wounded, but this went unanswered, and the offensive commenced with an artillery barrage and air attacks on April 13. The initial attack scattered many of the remaining German forces, some falling back towards Pila. The Soviet 115th Rifle Division broke through and cleared the 551st Volksgrenadier Division from Rauschen on the northwestern tip of Zambia. The German forces in the north of the peninsula, including the 95th Infantry Division and parts of Heavy Panzer Detachment 502, were driven southwards into Pomnikan and destroyed. By April 16, Soviet forces broke through near Fischhausen, parts of XXVI Corps, including the 5th Panzer and 28th Jaeger Divisions became cut off on the peninsula at peace, and were lost. A defense line, the Tenkaten Regal, had been improvised across the narrow strip of land leading to Pila, to break German resistance, the 11th Guards Army was committed on April 20. Fighting intensified at Tenkaten, where the commander of the 16th Guards Rifle Corps, Major General S. S. Gurev, was killed by a shell fragment on April 22. The German defensive perimeter was pushed back towards Pila, which was defended by elements of the 1st, 21st, 58th and other infantry divisions, remaining German troops were evacuated to the Frisch Nerung. Pila had been heavily fortified, being described by Bagramian as Königsberg in miniature, and was supported by fire from naval artillery and coastal batteries. After a stubborn defence, it was eventually stormed by units of 11th Guards Army, including the 31st Guards Rifle Division, on April 25, the town being cleared in around 12 hours. The last German position to fall was a battery commanded by Major General Karl Honk, which was overrun by the 16th Guards Rifle Corps on April 27. The Red Army claimed to have killed or taken prisoner 80,000 German troops during the operations in Zambia. The remnants of nine corps resisted on the Frisch Nerung to the end of the war, though the corps staff was removed to Bornholm. 
The headquarters of the Zeemland Group of Forces later became the headquarters of the Baltic Military District on July 9, 1945.